Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Kenny Wallace Show. Once again in NASCAR, we've got good drama. As I called it on the uh, Fox broadcast, I was so lucky. Great timing on my part. They brought me in on the second stage of the race. So let's start a character, right? This is what people are saying to me right now over on Snapchat and some of the other uh, social media sites. Hey, Wallace, since you run that mouth, then what do you think about old Ross Chastain, watermelon man, wrecking the whole damn field? <laughs> so let's talk about it. Let's have fun. I love you. You all, are, you all make, make me happy and uh, give me a lot of content to talk about it. We've been here before, right? Ernie Irvin. I don't know what year it was, maybe 25 years ago, could have been 30. If you search, Ernie Irvin wrecked the whole field a couple times. <laughs> Stood up in front of the complete driver's meeting at Talladega and apologized to everybody. So is Ross Chastain, is he there right now? Has Ross Chastain upset so many drivers in NASCAR? Is it time for him to apologize? Um, I personally like Ross Chastain a lot. He's a good man, hard driver, hard worker. Remember, we we got it. We kind of got this Harry Gant thing going on. We kind of got this uh, Dale Earnhardt Senior thing going on. Remember, Harry Gant built houses, and Ross Chastain is watermelon man. Works in the farm. Back to in the back working in the farm. You fans can relate. But here's the disclaimer. The drivers in the garage area are telling me that they've had enough of him. Now, I, I like Ross Chastain, so leave me out of it. But I'm going to give you my opinion on this deal. Ross Chastain on Sunday accidentally got into turn one too hard. <laughs> People go, I hate them damn air quotes. Accidentally. <laughs> got in turn one too hard. I saw the replay over and over. Remember, I was on the Fox broadcast. I saw it all. I was able to look at the analytics. I was able to look at his brake pressure and his gas. So I know something you don't know. He was actually all over the brake trying to stay off of Denny. You, you could see on, on the, 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 you know, the analytics right there, he was like, oh. But, you know, he, he done made that big mistake, and he ruined it. Denny and Hamlin's day. Now, you're going to say to me, but Denny Hamlin, he wrecks people. <laughs> right. So that's why it's a show. It's okay. Gotcha. But now, so many laps later, he wrecked the wrong person. <laughs> he, he was coming back to the front. Ross got a good car. Who did he wreck? Well, it wasn't his fault. He kind of squeezed in there, and Ross made it three wide. Remember what they say, pick your battles. Brother Rusty would say, Herman, be cautiously aggressive. This is a 300 lap race. This is lap 80 or 90. Ross is three wide, I gotta get back to the front. And he wrecks your man, the most popular driver in NASCAR. Besides Dale Earnhardt Jr., he wrecks Chase Elliott. Chase Elliott and all of his girlfriends, <laughs> are pissed. So uh, they drop the green flag. They're all in the back again. They get everything cleaned up. Everybody inside NASCAR. See, I'm privy to all the conversations. They're all like, go get Chase out or go get Ross Chastain. Everybody are all in their phones in the garage area saying, go wreck, go wreck Ross Chastain. Put a tire on that car, put a tire on that car. Danny Hamlet, and now, now we got two on one. So it played out just like we said. They go down in that corner, and um, I think it was McLeod got into, it was, it was funny, a guy that should have been in the situation, McLeod gets in to, uh, to, to Denny Hamlin or Ross, whoever it was, and all of a sudden, Chase Elliott gets Ross, then Denny Hamlin tries to finish him off. So, the question is this, 
Danny Hamlin came out and said, uh, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get Ross Chastain back when it's meaningful, when it matters. Ah, I've heard that somewhere else. It was the great Dale Senior says that old mustache legend. I get him back when it hurts. Oh man, Marlboro man, so awesome. You know, I wish I, we all could have been like Senior. Senior was a man's man. We all pretended to be him, but we weren't like him. He was the best. So is Denny Hamlin going to do, is he going to do that? Are we going to get deep into the playoffs? And is that going to happen? Now, Justin Marks, the car owner for Ross Chastain, said, my driver drove beautifully. That's what you got to do nowadays. Well, maybe at the end of the race, right? Maybe when it matters. There's an old saying, don't get a driver and give him a chance to get you back. So my opinion is this. Ross was too aggressive too early. Ross Chastain apologized after the race. It was the most beautiful apology. Everybody in racing loves Ross Chastain because he was a real man. He admitted it. I did a horrible job. Ross Chastain said I did a horrible job. I let all my sponsors down. So that's awesome. But are you like me? Are you a redneck? I'm from Arnold, Missouri. I'm going to get him back. Because he ruined my day. Tit for tat. Or do you go, I didn't mean it. So the bottom line is this. We're going to get into the playoffs. And they're going to keep score. We watched it play out year after year. Who is mentally the strongest? Remember, the key here is you have to get them and don't give them a chance to get you back. But now it's tit for tat. It's, it's, like a, it's like a tennis match or pong. Remember the game? Ding, dong, ding, dong. Boom. You can't let them come back. You can't let them serve back. So, you know, it, it's like a good baseball game. If you're going to pitch high at their head, you know, we see it all the time. If you, if you brush them off the plate at the waist is one thing. Going for their head you know, benches are going to be cleared. That's the way it is. So right now, because I know that everybody inside that garage area is really mad at Ross Chastain, I think that, you know, he can't, he, he can't drive like he's been driving. So that's where I'm going to leave it. Here's my opinion. Ross Chastain, even though we love him, he's a man's man, works in the farm, Reminds me of Ern Hart, like Ernie Urban. Okay, get it. It's too early in the year, right? He he got to be careful because he can't let them get him back. And they will get him back because they're lined up now, right? There's more than just Benny Hamlin and and and, and Chase Elliott. So uh, Ross is going to have to make sure when he enters the corners the rest of the year, he's going to have to back off a little bit. Trail break. So we've been, we, we've been, you know, so Ross has been died, mom. And now you got to do is go let off a little early, trail break in. So uh, his car's fast. They are in his way. All right. We're going to watch it play out. I've given you my opinion.